Fall Guys is more fun than it should be. It's an adorable experience where you have fun with your friends and family in a live service model. Hey guys, welcome to Ace Eyes for a new review. Today we are taking a look at Fall Guys Ultimate Knockout. Fall Guys is made by an indie developer. So I'm not really expecting the best graphics in the world. But Fall Guys is really attractive with its vibrant colors that it will be a perfect fit for a younger audience as well. It's like you are walking in a dreamlike world with cute little minions that are straight from a Pixar movie. I don't have a lot to say about the graphics. The game looks pretty sharp and with a bright color design which is just really appealing to anyone. The game is also pretty smooth and plays at a steady 30 frames a second. I didn't encounter any bugs or frame rate issues in my few multiplayer sessions that I played. However, there were some server issues at launch, but these were pretty quickly solved after a day or two. Sound design in the game is pretty straightforward. It has some cute sound effects for the different emotes that you can use in the game. And the soundtrack is pretty fun to listen to for longer play sessions. Overall, it's pretty decent. The gameplay in Fall Guys is what makes the game so appealing, especially for an indie title. It's so simple that you actually only need to know four controls on your controller or keyboard, which is move forward, rotate the camera, jump, and the grab button. That's it. Yeah, that's, that's it. It's a pretty short list. <laughs> that's all you need to know to play Fall Guys. Basically, everyone can do it. What is the concept of Fall Guys exactly? Well, Devolver Digital calls it a battle royale game with rotating mini games that you do with up to 60 of these cute minion characters at once. This creates a fun chaos where you have to survive until you are the last fall guy in the group. It is really fun to play with friends or even alone online because the concept is pretty basic and not to overcomplicate. Now here at Ace Eyes we aren't really the biggest fan of live service games because there are certain risks involved if the game doesn't get any support in the future. <laughs> but Fall Guys launch state is appealing enough now which is how a live service game should be. There are also microtransactions in the game but luckily they are only involved with the cosmetics of the game. There is also an in-game store where you can buy skins for your minions to customize them to your heart's content. But in my opinion, these customizations are a bit shallow in variety. Also, the game lacks some simple option settings that would have been appreciated, like visual settings or controller settings. There are basically only audio settings that you can change, which is somewhat disappointing. There is not really any story whatsoever in this game. And it's not really that important, so I'm going to skip this part for now. Fall Guys is really a fun game for any audience. While the base game is serviceable for now, we have to see in the future if the live service aspects evolve with new maps or game modes to hold the game relevant and I would have liked some more customization options available for the players. But overall, this game is really fun and a solid experience, and I really loved my time with it. This was our Ace Eyes review. As always, see you next time.